Hey, what's up, YouTube? Surreal Canine here, with more, uh, more Disgaea 4, the Time Leap episode. In the last episode, uh, Galatora has made the fateful promise to Artina. We'll uh, have to see what the fallout is from that, although you guys can probably guess if you've been paying attention to the series. That being said, must, uh, See what tragic fate fate has in store for us. Yeah, Artina ran off somewhere. We better go find her. What are you all doing here together? Is something going on? Oh, there she is. Hey, where'd you go, Artina? and check how the patients were doing, but I got caught up in a conversation. <laughs> you were being hit on? <laughs> I don't know. But at the clinic, I help people who are suffering emotionally as well as physically. Talking to them is part of my job. Martina, you can't go there anymore. That's right, and you can't go out by yourself anymore. Desco? I'm sorry for scaring you, but you don't have to say that. It makes me sad. The clinic is close to the battlefields, and many of the doctors and nurses have fled. I'm practically the only nurse left. There are many soldiers there who still need treatment. I can't just leave them. But... Fine. We're not gonna stop you from going there. After all, that is your job. But then we won't be able to change history! History? Um, don't worry about it. Um, anyway, why didn't that vampire go with you? Isn't he supposed to protect you? I asked him not to. I didn't want to be rude, but I thought he might scare the patients. And he agreed? What kind of spell did you use to convince him? Um... I can't tell you. We need to respect his privacy. Oh, okay. I don't want to upset him. Chances are she just asked. Max, does this alarm mean that a battle has started somewhere? Looks like it. Fuka, Desco, let's go. Miss Artina, you need to come with Mr. Valzi, okay? This is going to be dangerous. I understand. <laughs> Mr. Vampire, you look like you're deep in thought. What are you thinking about? Ah, yes. I'm coming up with ways to instill fear in you. Fear that will haunt your descendants. After seeing absolute terror on your face, I shall suck every single ounce of blood out of you. I see. Good luck. <laughs> you won't be able to say that for long. So what if I am? <laughs> so kind. You and like her. If you die, I won't be able to keep my promise. Yeah, I know. Now let's get going, Mr. Vampire. 
will do whatever it takes as a demon to bring you to the deepest depths of fear. No matter what! Alright, let's see here. Black Ice Roads. Using the monsters as shields so the soldiers won't get hurt. Both sides are thinking alike. This isn't even a war between humans anymore. But why are the monsters listening to the humans? Desco was summoned just like them, right? That's a good question. We're helping Nags, but it's not like we're following orders. Can't they just quit? If anything, you two are the special ones. You are incorrect! Mr. Vampire, are you saying that those monsters are the special ones? M m it's normal for monsters to obey the person who summoned them. That is a popular belief. However, in actuality, a demon does not have to serve the human that summoned it. The summoner voices their desires, and the demon decides to serve them or not. And, of course, the decision is not irreversible. So the upper hand actually lies with the summonee, not the summoner? What? I've never heard that before. However... The humans are using unusual spells to bind the demons with an unfair contract. Unusual? Are you saying that Rekadona and Gustark have modified their summoning spells? Is that why they don't take as much time to prepare and can summon so many at once? Exactly! And you would think that if anything, that would make the summon spells even harder. Hmm. Demons should not allow themselves to be controlled by <coughs> humans. I can't believe this. You don't have to believe me, but those are the facts. <gasps> this is it! A monster is right there! Oh crap, did they notice how close we've gotten? Well, I, I got so wrapped up in our conversation that I didn't notice. It's just one zombie dragon. We can take him. How disgraceful. Mr. Vampire, what are you... Weak fools! I shall awaken you with my fists! I thought you used swords, Valzy. Oh. I see. Way to go, Bowsy! You show him! Huh? Something's wrong! Oh, criminy. I haven't feasted in quite a while, and now I can't exert my full power! Mr. Bowsy, you need a tune-up! Oh, fine. We'll help you out. Let's go, Nags. Huh? The vampire can't do anything about the monsters? Don't you see? We gotta do something other than complain. You're right, but is he okay? He looks a little dry. Uh, he's not gonna try to suck my blood, is he? Don't worry about him. He'll feed on me before anyone else. Screw it. Level 3200. I do believe his level has gone down. This isn't like, this won't actually be all that hard.
Antonio. care of those guys. It's still got a bunch of dudes to deal with, but that's fine. Here right? I go. Should be fine. Here I go. Return. Chop your head off. Bad guys beware. These guys didn't even try to go after me. Go figure. Valzi, are you even gonna do anything? I guess it's no. Can you trust a human's word? Well... A promise is a contract. I will not break it. Until that lass experiences true fear, I will not suck any blood. I see. That's good then. He's trying to keep his promise even though he's like this. This vampire... Isn't really a bad person. Is that guy okay? He isn't moving at all. He appears to be unconscious. Is it too late to help him? No, I'll save him no matter what. But I can't do much for him here. We need to take him to the clinic. You mean the 
one near the border? Yes, there should be enough equipment there for me to help him out, and it'll be safer there, too. But, but this is a Regadona soldier. Isn't the clinic in Gustav? Is this Nino? who's been helping the Wrecked Donut soldiers, aren't you? Crap! It's a Ghost Surf soldier! And he heard us! You're a spy! I received a report about you caring for a lieutenant commander. Lead us to it, now! If you hand them over, we'll spare your life! Damn it! These guys are gonna take our Tina! I refuse. What? You're gonna side with the enemy? My clinic takes no sides. It takes in anyone who needs help. You foolish traitor! If you defy us any further, I'll execute you right here and now! My mission is to save as many lives as possible. I won't follow your orders just because you're threatening me. I guess it's no use talking to you. I shall bring the full weight of Gustav justice upon you. Uh. Don't get ahead of yourself. If you lay a finger on her, you'll have to deal with me. Dasko will fight you too. Dasko doesn't think she can hold this much anger in. Uh, I'll... What? Are you siding with this spy? Don't you know that you'll be charged with the same crime? <laughs> what was that? That lass is mine! I will not allow you to kill her until I have feasted on her blood! <gasps> it's a monster! <laughs> Tina, what are you doing? That's dangerous! Help! Please, take this potion. If you don't tend to your injuries, they'll cause problems for you in the future. Fall back! Report to headquarters! I won't forget your faces! Gonna kill her soon? But what should we do? Good question, Nagi. Very good question. <laughs> Let us go out this evening for pleasure. The night is still young. <laughs> well, uh, things are going to take a turn pretty very tragic soon. 
Tune in next time and we will see how exactly. Bye bye for now.